Edgar Allan Poe was an American writer, poet, editor, and literary critic, best known for his dark and macabre tales and poems. He was born on January 19, 1809, in Boston, Massachusetts, and died under mysterious circumstances on October 7, 1849, in Baltimore, Maryland. Poe's works are often associated with the genres of Gothic fiction and Romanticism. Poe was born to David Poe Jr. and Elizabeth Arnold Hopkins Poe. Both of his parents were actors. After his father abandoned the family and his mother passed away when he was just three years old, Poe was taken in by John and Francis Allen, a wealthy tobacco merchant and his wife in Richmond, Virginia. Poe began his literary career as a poet and writer, and his first collection of poems, Tamerlane and Other Poems, was published anonymously in 1827. He worked as an editor and critic for various literary magazines, where he gained a reputation for his harsh and often controversial literary criticism. Some of Poe's most famous works include The Telltale Heart, The Fall of the House of Usher, The Raven, and The Cask of Amontillado. Poe's works often explore themes of death, madness, and the supernatural. His writing is characterized by its dark and mysterious atmosphere intricate plots and psychological depth. Poe is also known for his use of symbolism and allegory, as well as his mastery of language and rhythm. Despite struggling with poverty and facing numerous personal tragedies throughout his life, Poe's works have had a lasting impact on literature and culture. He is considered one of the pioneers of the modern detective story, and is often credited with popularizing the short story as a literary form. Poe's influence can be seen in the works of many later writers, including H.P. Lovecraft, Arthur Conan Doyle, and Stephen King. Edgar Allan Poe left behind one final enigma as he neared death. The ailing author, renowned for works like The Tell-Tale Heart and The Raven, was discovered in a disheveled and seriously ill state in Baltimore on October 3, 1849, at the age of 40. Consumed by delirium, he could not communicate the nature of his illness or account for his whereabouts over the previous six days. He had departed from Richmond, Virginia, with the intention of traveling to Philadelphia, a journey from which he never returned. When Poe was found, he was dressed in clothes that did not appear to be his own, and his condition failed to improve. He passed away on October 7th. The attending physician diagnosed him with phrenitis, also known as brain congestion, a term sometimes euphemistically associated with excessive drinking. Since his death, historians have proposed various theories about the cause of his demise, ranging from the commonplace, such as alcoholism, tuberculosis, or a random physical assault, to the more sensational. Some suggest that Poe may have been drugged and coerced into participating in an election fraud scheme known as cooping, which was prevalent in Baltimore at the time. Another theory posits that he was afflicted with rabies after being bitten by an infected cat. The disappearance of Poe's medical records has only deepened the mystery surrounding his death. In his delirium, Poe managed to utter just one word, Reynolds. The identity of Reynolds and the role it played in his death remain unresolved mysteries to this day. Write your thoughts in the comments section below.